One issue on the agenda at City Hall is the future of Casa Loma. The city-run castle has a $20 million backlog in repairs, and now two city councilors propose transforming it from a castle to a museum. Kimberly Gale explains. Once upon a time, Sir Henry Pellet called Casa Loma home. But in the decades since then, as it's opened as a tourist attraction, it's fallen in need of repairs and revitalization. It's been a, very sad through the, our family's history that it's, it's never been properly restored back to what it was before. Trelawney Howell is the great-grandniece of Sir Pellet. With the building's future uncertain, she wants it to return to its past. Sir Henry Pellet, when he built it, had always thought he would like to see its future use as a military museum. And a museum about Toronto is what City Councillor Josh Matlow is now proposing. I think it's time that we finally celebrate, protect and share our city's history in a building that is just as iconic and historical. Toronto doesn't have a museum large enough to showcase its vast collection of artifacts. Right now, most are tucked away inside warehouses. Councillors Matlow and Joe Mahevic see an opportunity. As the city asks for ideas to revitalize the castle, they want any plans to include space for a museum. If we have events and restaurants, that will complement a museum, and certainly a museum would complement those types of operations as well. A Toronto Museum is just one of the ideas being proposed for the future of Casa Loma. Others include restaurants, retail, even condos. It'll all be discussed October 2nd at City Council. Kimberly Gale, CBC News, Toronto. Now, as Kimberly mentioned, the city has thousands of artifacts and no real place to display them, but you can see some of them online, like this one, this Blue Jays World Series memor memorabilia can. The Toronto Museum Project is a virtual museum of the city. You can go to torontomuseumproject.ca to check it out.